National Highways of Pakistan are a network of trunk roads which are owned, maintained and operated by the NHA under the Ministry of Communications. It maintains 12,131 kilometers of roadways organized into various classifications which crisscross the country and provide access to major population centers. One of them is National Highway N70 that connects 440 kilometers between Multan in South Punjab and Koita, the capital of Balochistan. It is a major route from east to west across center of Punjab that eventually provides shortest route between Lahore and Koita. Project site is located in DG Khan district at the border of Punjab and Balochistan. Particularly Rakhi Gaj Bevata section of N70 is known to be the most critical section in terms of road safety due to very narrow roadway, sharp curves, steep slopes in geometric condition and hazardous condition such as unstable roadside slopes, rock fall and flooding of crossing rivers. These situations are causing not only serious traffic accidents and huge maintenance cost, but also adverse economic effect by distracting logistics from N70. ट्रक जब जाता है लोड गाड़ी होती है तो मोड़ नहीं मुड़ता आगे पीछे करना है और गाड़ी स्लिप हो के गिर भी जाती है बाद अकात the project to improve the Rakhi Gaj Bewada section was proposed by NHA to facilitate mobility of both people and goods between east and west of Pakistan and to contribute to socio-economic development of Pakistan. To achieve this target, the government of Japan had provided loan of 15.5 billion Japanese yen to government of Pakistan through Japan International Cooperation Agency JICA in 2008. To plan, design and execute the project, CTI Engineering International as consultant and Taisi Corporation as the contractor were selected among Japanese firms by NHA. The construction phase 1 to improve the most critical section for 11.6 km was implemented for three years from 2016 to 2019. Concept of the project is to eliminate the traffic bottleneck through widening of existing road to two lanes in whole stretch between Raki Gajpewata, preventing the roadside disasters such as rockfall and landsliding, and improving road alignment with gentle curve for safe driving. To realize above concepts, customized application of Japanese technologies consists of steel box girder bridge, prefabricated steel widening, mechanically stabilized earth, formed cement banking, slope protection by ground anchor work were employed by the design consultant. Seven steel box girder bridges made of anti-corrosion steel with total length of 705 meter were applied to improve the road alignment at very sharp curve. Initially at hilly slopes, excavation work was done to form deep foundation by placing steel liner plate and reinforced concrete. Afterwards, piers and abutments were constructed on it to support steel bridge girders. In parallel with the construction of substructures at construction site, fabrication of steel box girders at factories were carried out. Welded steel plates were fabricated by the Japanese fabricator. As specific technology of Japan, anti-corrosion steel was used to minimize maintenance caused by weathering of steel. Eventually, a dense rust is formed on the other surface of steel that ensures lifetime protection. After fabrication, these steel bridge girders were transported to project site. Launching and erection of these steel girders were carried out by using 170 heavy cranes and were fixed by high tension bolts then completed with the reinforced concrete desk slab.
for widening of two-lane carriageway at hilly area. Prefabricated steel widening method were selected for this. Customized fabrication of steel frames and steel pipes was done at factory to shape up bridged steel frame structures. Drilling of rocky slopes was done using down the hole hammer composed of hydraulic hammering and steel drilling with super alloy. Then steel pipes were placed in it like piers. Prefabricated superstructure was erected in the combination with steel pipes continuously by crane and firmly fixed. Reinforced concrete deck slab was constructed in the place to complete the widening. To form consistent high embankment in the limited space, mechanically stabilized earth wall offers quick solution. This technology has been commonly utilized through bitter earthquake experience in Japan. To apply this technology, excavation was done along sides of embankments, then installation of steel skin panel and geocrate implemented and embankment with compaction were repeated to establish stabilized earth embankment. With shearing force is strengthened, the friction between embankment material and geocrate enable high and strong flexible embankment to resist earthquake. Finally, shortcrete is provided on the surface of skin panel to cover up the embankment. To widen the road with high embankment on the unstable slope at hilly area, formed cement banking is applied as a best solution. This methodology is known as a part of the lightweight embankment using form mixed cement by special mixed plant. Excavation, concrete shuttering and drainage facility are constructed prior to pouring the formed cement. Special mixing plan for formed cement was prepared. Then cement was mixed with the form produced by the chemicals to create lightweight concrete. Since the unit weight of the formed cement is lighter than the water, even unstable slope can support high embankment due to its light weight. To address slope failure at a large cutting slope, ground anchor work was applied. The principle of this methodology is to reinforce capacity of the loose force surface by PC cable made of steel wires. To improve road alignment of the project, large scale of slope cutting was carried out at an unstable mountain. Subsequently, horizontal drilling was carried out until sufficient rock bed was found to install the PC cables for ground anchor. After installation of the steel wires, drilled holes are filled by grounding mixture of cement water and solidifying materials to anchor in the rock bed. After grouting is completed, concrete bearing block is constructed to provide tensioning to the steel wire to balance opposing forces. Shortcut is constructed on the exposed earth slope to prevent further weathering of the slope condition. Uh, I think in this country, there will be a significant advantage of tourism, which is the Fort Monroe Hayes Camp, there will be help to come there. और जो हम कहते हैं कि ये एक पंजाब और बलूचिस्तान का एक लिंक है इसको उस तरफ ये जो प्रोजेक्ट है ये एक कामयाबी की अपनी ही मिसाल है ऑल द कंस्ट्रक्शन वर्क वाज एग्जीक्यूटेड इन द कोलैबोरेशन विद एनएचए द कंसलटेंट एंड द कॉन्ट्रैक्टर ड्यूरिंग 2016 टू 2019 इन वेरी रगेड एनवायरमेंट द कंस्ट्रक्शन वर्क वाज वेयरली हैंपर्ड बाय हैजर्डस रॉक फॉल एज वेल एज एक्सक्वेशन ऑफ हार्ड रॉक्स under heavy traffic passing by the construction site to completely turn around and an undulating and risking road into a safe route for drivers has been a long awaited public craving over the years now it's a time for a new beckoning for all those who are affected by hazards of traveling on such tough hilly road abhi bade bade gaadi idhar se guzar ga karte hain ये लोगों के लिए हमारे इलाके के लिए खुशहाली है रोड को जो है ना इन शाह हमें बहुत फायदा हुआ बलोच पंजाब की जो इलाके में बहुत फायदा हुआ बहुत सहलत हो गया बहुत खुश है हम लोग जिसने ये रोड और सड़क बनाए है और पुल बनाए उनके मैं बहुत शुक्र गुजार हूँ This project has shown that any difficult conditions can overcome with the innovative idea and power of technology and bridging life through technology is a promised goal experienced by Japan.